Hey, welcome back to Trucking with Trip. This is Trip. Uh, I'm starting off my uh, last leg of the run down to Plant City. I'm going over to get fuel. And uh, we're going to boogie woogie on down the road uh, with a, one little minor incident. Um, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a little disappointing to have people like this out on the road. I don't know if anybody heard me from my last video video, not the one where I was uh, picking up in uh, Burnside, Kentucky, but the one before that where I said, you know, boogie-woogie down the road, but do it safe and do it respectfully. Well, this just shows what frame of mind this uh, younger generation coming up, um, as my dad would call them, punks, hoodlums, well, hoodlums more like my grandfather, um... I can't say what I actually want to call them. Uh, I'm trying to keep this channel pretty much profanity-free. Uh, so I do a lot of uh, retakes on my voiceovers So because I catch myself using profanity and not even realizing it. But anyways, yeah, they... I mean, it just shows, just their vehicle alone shows that, that you know, they are punks. You know, they've, got, they've had poor parenting. Uh, it's, it's totally ridiculous, uh, with what they do, but I'm following the law. Uh, I pull over because there is an individual, uh, vehicle, uh, on the side of the road, passenger door open. I do see an individual standing there. I do what I was taught. I do what the law tells me. If I can get over, I get over. So I got over to the, uh, inside lane, uh, and then, uh, moved back. There was nobody in my in the slow lane coming up uh well at least the, the, they were coming up but they were so far back they were a good 15 20 car lengths back but yet they still found it necessary to uh tell me i'm number one i slow the video down it's coming up here in a, in, a, in a few seconds but i do slow the video down to show uh you know the vehicle uh, i i don't understand why you raise your vehicle up and then dump the back end so you can't see all over the roof of your car here we go uh, they're coming up here in a second. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's really upsetting that we have people like this running around the country. And, and you know, when I was a kid, if I acted like that, I usually was taken out someplace and, and uh, was given an attitude adjustment. There's the guy, there's the vehicle, I'm coming back. But yeah, uh, you know, I'd be given an attitude adjustment and it'd straighten me out, you know. There they are, right there. Um yeah, it's uh, disappointing that that um, they're they're allowed to 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 run around and and basically, you know, offend people for no reason. So uh, yeah, if you noticed when I came back in the lane, it took a while for them to catch up and pass me. So they were nowhere near me cutting them off. Far from it. They were about a half mile back, maybe a little bit closer, but still. They were about 15, 20 cars back, at least. So I had plenty of room to come back. They were just, you know, just showing uh, their mentality. And and, and uh, it's surprising that they get away with stuff like that in the world. You know, like I said, I, I would have been taken out back if, uh, if I would have done that to one of my elders. Uh, I was taught to always respect my elders. But if I would have done that and my elder put their hand on me, I knew not to fight back, and I would end up literally having an attitude adjustment. So, yeah, the rest of the run and, and that part before the run was really great. That little section, nothing really to complain about. I just wanted to point it out that we do have individuals that really have no care for, for society or the way people are supposed to act in society. Um, like I say, it's it, to me, it's, it's really... Lack of parenting, 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 and uh, you know I, I just see a, a, a life of crime and, and prison time uh, for them in the future. Uh, you know tinted windows. Uh, you know California, you can't have that. Well, when I was younger, you couldn't have tinted windows that dark. Uh, you got pulled over immediately and searched and and all that. So I can imagine what they had in the vehicle. That's why I didn't. Uh, antagonize or or prolong the situation uh to cause them to want to come back and do anything to me 
So yeah, I'm just finishing up this run here. Uh, my next run is actually going to be coming from um, Plant City through Tampa, well, outskirts of Tampa, uh, up 75, then uh, over to the 10, and then out to Jacksonville. And uh, right now, where I stopped at is uh, Lee, Florida. And uh, here, here I am at the receiver. So yeah, the Lee, Florida, right now, and. Uh, I hope everybody does well today. Have a wonderful day, and uh, I'll see you on the flip side. Peace out.